So I, I grew up in upstate New York, you know, and it, it snowed. It used to snow a lot in, in upstate New York. And I think this one winter, it's just like, I don't want to do this. I'm just not going to deliver the papers today. I just, I don't want to get out of bed. It's too cold. You know, my parents won't drive me because <laughs> they don't want to get up either. So I used to have to either walk, you know, in, in the neighborhood that I grew up in is like it's sprawling. So it's like the houses are really far apart. Um, or I had to ride my bike, which was just nightmare. So I was just like, forget it. And of course, like everyone on my route started calling the the paper, like, "Where's my paper?" And they called me, and I was just like, "Yeah, I'm, I, I didn't. I'll just I'll do it later." And I'm like, "This isn't gonna work. This is not how a paper boy works. You need to deliver the paper." I'm like, "They can just come to me." No, no, they're not gonna come to you. You've got to deliver the papers. They fired me. <laughs> it was. I was saying that uh, I've really enjoyed my time here. Oh, good. And I've learned so much from you. That's good to hear. Uh, sorry about that. Nine Quite. times, and that might yeah. even be conservative. Um, and each time, it's like, oh, my God, this is horrible. What am I going to do? And then something else comes along. I mean, it does not feel good to get fired. I mean, I've been fired from acting gigs, too. I mean, that that was actually the only time where I really cared. I think my, my other jobs is like, you know, getting fired from, you know, washing dishes or, um, you know, bartending or landscaping or cleaning gutters. I had some horrible jobs. I had some terrible jobs that I was happy to be fired from. But I got fired from an acting gig for no other reason. Just I wasn't the right guy. I was, I was miscast, and I... I didn't want to be there because it just it wasn't working. But was still, as a young actor, when that happens, it's like, oh, my God, I'm never going to work again. And everyone they, they could not have been nicer about it, you know? And it, everyone was like, even apologetic because it was, you know, we were all sort of wasting each other's time. It's like, and no one wants that. It's when, when you're working on something creative, it's like everyone really needs to sort of fit the mold of, of what they're doing. And I didn't at the time. It's no hard feelings, and I've worked with a bunch of those people again since then, so...